our first interview tonight is with uh, Dave Sam. I don't need to give you any further particulars about Dave because I don't suppose there is any Australian sporting personality better known in the world. Eh? How are you, Dave? A very good of you to give us this time. I know you must have plenty to do with your big fight on tonight. Dave, um, did you think doing fights before? No, I never tried fight before, but what they say about him is pretty good fight. Yes, I think he is too. Perhaps not uh, after your fast and fairness, but a good fight is just the same, and it certainly won't be an easy fight. I don't think you were even expecting that, were you? No, no. Uh, Dave, we would like to get a comment from you regarding your recent visit uh, to England. First of all, did you feel that uh, in England you ever reached your, your top form? No, not the, not the last bit. Not the last bit. Can you give any reason for that? Well, I just said it over there, you know. You probably never could get your weather over there. Yes, and so you found you couldn't tell. Sort of feel yourself. Yeah. How about the boxing game in England generally, compared to, uh, with Australia? Are our conditions good? I mean, do they look after fighters? Oh, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Solomon and, and company are very good people to do business with. Oh, yes, yeah. people. Mm -hmm. uh, what about the future? Is uh, Solomon's uh, anything lined up for you at all, if you know? Well, there's um, three fights offered to me. I got a table last night, I think, Dad. Did you? Yes. I don't know what you know, do about it yet. You wouldn't like to comment on it at this stage? No. Uh, Dave, you, you've been promised, I think, several times, or you've been several times that you'd meet Serpin or Robinson, but that seems as far as they get with it. Do you think there's any likelihood of getting a fight with either of them in the near future? Uh, well, if there's anybody who can get it, it'll be Jack Solomon. Yes. And you think, you, do you feel confident that you're the man who's put in against them? Oh, I think so, yes. Mm -hmm. You saw the Serpin Robinson fight in England? Yes. What did you think of it? Well, uh, Robertson wasn't any, wasn't any tough, but Kevin being yes. very easy. Can you give any reason about it? Seems that all my, it seems very strange, yes. A man of Robertson's experience, and uh, he's a very thorough, seems that way, that he got into the ring, not at his top. Oh, well, I think uh, he thought he had a push over, but he did. Mm -hmm. yes. And uh, it sounds like a different matter. Oh, yes. Evidently, he was right at his top when the fight came on in America. Oh, he was right at his top. No, the West Serpent must be a grand fighter. Yes, good fight. Mm -hmm. You meet them with the Serpent family there? Eh? Yes, I met them all there. Eh? Yes. A very nice fellow, too, I believe. Yes, right. mm -hmm. Well, uh, Dave, uh, I would like to bring to the microphone uh, Mr. B. Kerr. Uh, your associate here at the present time, and hasn't been doing quite a lot of work for you. Yeah, no. they're listening. No, you sure. Very well, thank you. Uh, might I be permitted to express my gratitude for the courtesies extended to Dave during his visit to Melbourne by Mr. Spartel, Mr. Uh, Peggy uh, Spartel. I would say that the Spartel setup compares more than favourably with anything in the southern hemisphere. Good, that's very good of you to say, and I'm glad you did too. We would like to extend our thanks to Spartel for um, making uh, his space available for this interview. This interview, ladies and gentlemen, this is a delayed for cut car taking place in the Spartel gymnasium, where of course Dave is working out during his stay in, in Melbourne. Um, would you say that uh, you consider, you think Dave in his fight and uh, in his battle career, but, um, would you say that uh, you consider, you've seen Dave in his fights and uh, throughout his career very closely, I imagine. Yes, I have personally supervised Dave's uh, training for this contest with Ron Tui tonight. Uh, Dave has trained very conscientiously for five weeks. He has had the assistance of his brother Alfie, who has won 18 consecutive fights with his sparring partner, Clem, his brother, and Richie, who was the original fan to take part in boxing. And Richie fought for the heavyweight championship of Australia. They've been rather an outstanding uh, uh, team, haven't they, in the ring? Yes, there are really five brothers that have been fighting, mm -hmm. and I'm going to make a long-range prediction. We have the best of the fans to come. Is that so? That is Russell. He is a, a southpaw, yes. which boxing authorities uh, term a Morley Hander. He's 13 years of age, and we think he's going to be great. Well, who is this stage of predicting yes. that? Yes. Uh, no, he, he'll do the school, he? Yes. The critics that have seen him box with uh, his more famous brother, Dave, well, they are quite taken with the, at this stage of his career, what looks in future for him. Well, I, I think that's something we all like to see, uh, uh, Dave working out with his young brother, although somehow or other I feel inclined to think that Dave might be a little easy here and there on him. Yes. Well, during our next visit to Melbourne, which I hope is not as too different to Dave, uh, I think it could be arranged to be effective for along with it. Well, that would be grand. I'm, I'm sure that uh, 
he seemed very good hands over here, and everybody would say that he was very well looked after. Oh, yes, so he's a very fine lad, and that's, of course, all the fans' boys are. There's no need to say anything different, because everybody knows that he's uh, a very fine lawyer. Yes. Dave, could you come back to the microphone, please? It's hard to get in the yard of Dave. He, he fights uh, fast, but he doesn't talk yeah. fast, believe you me. What about the family? Uh, Dave, uh, can you give us any background, the story of the, the fans' family, how they came to get into the game? Who was sort of instrumental in pushing you forward? Oh, Richard. Richard started everything off. Uh, is he Richard the elder brother? Well, he's not the eldest, but he's the second eldest. He came down and tried to fight first. Oh, he was the first to fight. Yeah. And that gave everybody else the same idea. Oh, well, we came down to just company with him and then we started to fight too. Then. That was in Newcastle and the Southern? Newcastle, yeah. Mm. Mm. The Tom Yes, yeah, he has to be grandfather too, Richard. Oh, yes, he was a good father. Would, uh, does he still uh, put on the glove to uh, bar with you? Oh, yes. Mm. Mm. And what about the, uh, what about mum or dad? I presume that they are still uh, uh, with you? No, uh, the father's dad, the mother's still alive. Ah, oh, well, mum, is she uh, a keen supporter of the game? Oh, yes, yes. She likes it? Oh, yes, she likes it. Oh, she's very, very proud of you. In fact, proud of all of you. Oh, yes. And what about the young brother? Which one, uh, 12, isn't he? What's his name? No, uh, he's been made a mistake. He's been 15. 15? Yes. Uh, big, big boy? Oh, well, he's not too big, but he'll be all right later on. Uh, he's, I'll guarantee he's getting some very careful children, oh, yes. eh? Well, he's in very good hands, and uh, I think all, uh, every failure will be very happy that there is another fan to step in the ring and, and take over the the, um, the reputation that you've earned yourself. Not only as a boxer, but as a, a man in the Dutch jet, too. Well, Dave, uh, I know that you want to get to work, and uh, we have anything to do, too. Especially these days, but anyone is. No. Uh, the very best of luck in your fight with Sue tonight. We know it'll be a grand fight. More especially, we have very good luck in the future, and we do hope that you'll get a crack at the Serpent or Robinson in England or America in the near future. You've been waiting a long time for it. I think you thoroughly deserve it, and I'm sure whatever happens, victorious or defeated, you've got a very good showing. Thank you very much, Dave Bands, and be sure.